probably adjust the nightbot to chill out a little bit. Yeah, but. dang, no, nightbot <laughs> putting putting trash man on timeout. Because he said work in all caps. <laughs> all right, we're going to change that. And in the meantime, we're going to hop right into it. Going to be Zas LML versus Voldo. I think I heard Yeltail say he just wanted the range, which makes sense. And speaking of range, he's getting that big combo off the lethal hit. Yeah, you know, I was thinking the other day, who else plays Zas if DJ doesn't? And I forgot that Yeltail does. So. Zaz is like an in vogue character after Texas Showdown. Like, Zaz has did so well. <laughs> but in the meantime, as soon as I say that, he's getting comboed. The low will take it from it, though. Fight kicking the trash out. <laughs> oh, boy. Good block on the low. Oh, wow. Second hit connects. Put another launch. Okay. Do it again. Oh, Ooh, and he gets, gets the lethal to the wall. Yeah, it's going to hurt. I don't know if he gets a wall splat. Oh, I guess oh, not. I guess, wow. But this damage is still nothing to, to be disappointed in. Great C, though. All right. Take a break. This should make uh, give him the life lead. Just enough. Camera on the wrong side. Oh. Did he get him? He got him. C to C. Got him. Camera on the wrong side. Oh. 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 I accidentally pause. I don't think it's a big deal. He bows. He's got the curse. Wow, we get the scythe in the shot. <laughs> Depending on the character, you get some weird things. I know with Gro, like, I played him and Gro's shoes were busted, so I just kept getting Gro's toes in the shot. It was, like, really weird. Um, That's the wrong feet. People don't want them feet. I mean, someone wants them, but not most. With. Wow, huge oh, range on that one. And he's gonna actually gonna try to salvage his round with a soul charge. Oh wow! Get the time stop, and there it is. Yeah, and again the CR. I'm not sure. I think if you land that time stop off grounded, you do get an 8B plus K or some sort of conversion, but he missed it there. In any case, Manta taking that one pretty convincingly. Um, Switch so characters. he's going to change characters, yeah. Alrighty. Yeah, and that was pretty convincingly in Anthem's favor, so we'll see. I, I'm guessing he's going to switch to Grow, I don't know. Or, we'll see. I don't know who else he plays, so. Yeah, it looks like Grow. Alright. Alright, let's see it. Yeah, uh, is Indeed. that one of Voldo's new colors? Yeah, that's uh, that's Voldo's uh, four color option four. Now? Yeah, yep. Indeed. It's it's, fr it's from one of the previous games, isn't it? Or no. is it just no? It's just a color change, oh, okay. so it can't be from the previous games. So you guys, I don't know. The color fours they usually change some sort of prop. Like Mina starts with her hair short, Sophie starts with her shirt busted, blouse busted, and Voldo starts with his mask <laughs> changed. And wow, there's tons of pressure coming out to start here. He chooses to back away, I guess, scared of a ring out. We're back in the middle of the stage, and now this Mantis pressure has brought it close. Scorpion kick. Wow. Just like that. Manta takes, turns that round around. He got hit all the way to the edge and then worked it back. Okay. Oh, and the lethal hit. Really weird lethal hit. He has to hit with your wrist. Great DB, keeping the pressure going here, but the whiff, big whiff punish. And another whiff punish on the RE attempt. Good block on the low. Tries to get, I don't know if that was maybe a missed input. You can get that, that kick off of like 3-3-K also, with like 3 3 9 so. Oh, maybe. Okay, try to start off with the 6-8 plus B lethal hit, blocked by Manta. Another launch. Wow, he's hitting a ton of these lows. The second you try to take your turn anyway, you need a GI. Nope, it was my turn. All right. No tail, last chance here. 
Good bait on the, <laughs> on the hook. Yeah. Good block and punish. Yeah. This is the 1AK. Another 1AK. Man, they're just not darting his toes. Oh, goes for another one. Great break, and he's going to have to spend another bar here to stay alive in this in the tournament. Again, Nanta was too antsy. Nice. Blocked the second one. I mean, it does work most of the time, but. Oh, wow, he's going to hit again. All right, so. With that. Oh wow! Oh, tries to punish the. Yeah. All right, he's trying to get his stance okay, but it's great block, no punish. Another low, last pixel here. Great lethal hit. Oh, but he drops the combo. Oh, no. painful. Gets the great 4-4K lethal hit. Um, you need to do B plus K. It's really weird, and this is something I mess up now that I'm playing Grow Bit. If you land a raw six B plus K, then the follow up is Avenger A plus B. But if you land counter hit B plus K or B plus K in any sort of lethal hit combo, then you need to do Avenger B plus K. So I, I don't know if he mixed, hit the wrong button, got mixed up, but that is something kind of weird about it. Like, um, in any case.